Uh, good morning, students. Now I'm going to relay the basic mistake which we students do in university practicals on this bleeding time. So this is Duke's method, which you will be knowing. So what I do, first as usual, I sterilize my finger, which I'm going to prick with the spirit, and then before that, you can make the blotting paper into just like this, just for marking like this, 0 seconds, 30 seconds, 16 seconds. I better prefer 15 seconds. So whatever your college has taught you, that is okay. You divide it into seconds, either 0, 15, 30, or 0, 30, 60. So the principle is, I'm just going to prick, blood comes. Bleeding time definition is from the time of prick to stoppage of bleeding. Yeah, that and all you can able to understand. So now I'm pricking. I already sterilized. So what I do? Yeah, just I prick there. You can see there. Yeah, now I mark it. So immediately if I keep, you can see the red color. Immediately if I keep, that is zero seconds. Then I will note the time. After 15 seconds, yeah, I'm still having the blood, you can see. Then again, I wait for 15 seconds. So I will mark here zero, 15, 30. Then again, I'm able to get the blood drop. So zero seconds, I was able to get the blood drop red color. 15 seconds, blood drop. 30 seconds, blood drop. Yeah, 45 seconds, blood drop. Now what some students do, they mark this zero. Because zero is, if I keep immediately the blood drop after pricking. Some students, what mistake they do after pricking, they wait for 15 seconds and then keep, then you should mark it as 15. So it's not hard and fast rules. If you keep the first drop immediately after pricking, it is zero seconds. I kept immediately. So this is zero, 15, 30, 45. Yeah, now after 60 seconds. So now no blood drop. Yeah, now the mistake which you people commonly make is everyone will tell bleeding time is 45 seconds, which is not because still I have blood, I don't know whether blood stopped or not. But why, why am I here marking it with pen to show that there is no more blood or no more bleeding has occurred. So my bleeding time is by Duke's method is one minute and not 45 seconds. So the main aim of the shots is you have to keep the blood drop until there is no blood. Some students say that's why I want to put this. They say, sir, at 45 seconds, the last blood drop is over. So the bleeding time is 45 seconds. No, because I don't know when the bleeding stopped. But at 60 seconds, bleeding stopped because there is no blood drop. So here the bleeding time is 60 seconds. So the precautions which you have to take is after sterilizing your finger, when you're going to keep the blood drop, note this time. If you're going to keep it immediately, this should mark it as zero seconds. And here, when there is no more bleeding, that is 60 seconds. So here, according to this procedure, the bleeding time is one minute. So don't do these two mistakes. Thank you.